everybody, I am totally coming at you at not your regular days and time. So, <laughs> hi, happy Saturday. It's Molly, Mackenzie, Joy, and Athena from So and So's Place. Yay! Yay! We got so much fabric in. We are buried, and I just couldn't wait till Tuesday. So, there yeah. you go. Here we are. All right, first of all, we're going to talk about some quick classes because Joy is here and she's one of our instructors. Say hi, Joy. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's see. Coming up next week, we are going to be doing the Yellowstone Beth Dutton quilt because we had to do a little bit of changing in our schedule, which, hey, we're small, we can do that, and we love okay. to accommodate everybody. This is the Yellowstone quilt. We have some of the patterns made up for folks who just want to do this pattern with their own fabrics. But these kits have been flying out of the store. So we have some of them with the variations and we have some of them with solids. So I didn't bring them all over here, but there are some um, on the website right now. And as we sell them out, we refill as much as we can. So they are there, they're available, they're here at the store. Those of you watching online, you can order online, we ship, or you can stop by here, 282nd Avenue, Dayton, Tennessee, and pick up your own. We're here Tuesday through Friday, 10 to 5.30, and Saturdays, 10 to 2. All right, next online, um, the clothesline uh, heart, the structured mm -hmm. one. This is the structured one, so it's firmer than the easy peasy one that Carrie was doing today. This one is a lot firmer and sturdier, so you can put things in it and it'll stand up. She's going to be doing that one again. It's coming up. Keep an eye on the schedule. It is uh, Wednesday the 25th or Saturday the 28th. So this is a fun one. Carrie is amazing. You will enjoy her. Hi, Linda. Hi, Linda. All right. Uh, Joy is also going to be doing a Table Tastic 2 sew along. This is going to be monthly, isn't it, Joy? Um, so we're going to be doing this one, and uh, we have the books here, and what we're going to do is every month, Joy, we're going to be choosing uh, one out of here and do it every month together, and we'll be doing it over in the classroom. So we have the books. Come on in, get a book. Joy's going to choose, and we're, you're going to have some input into which one she chooses for yours in the first one. And this is going to be a lot of fun. So these are just beautiful. Nice gifts. gifts. Yes, wonderful. Because this way, you know, you're getting a head start on all your holiday sewing as well. <laughs> um, AccuQuilt. Lauren, who did the wonderful murder mystery that, remember, that we just did a part. She is going to be doing an AccuQuilt demo class coming up on... Um, Friday the 10th of February. You do not, not have to be an AccuQuilt owner to participate and gain some knowledge and information from this class. And if you have one, bring it and she will show you how to use it. If you don't have one, please come and sign up, participate in that anyway, because she's going to teach you how to use one and you may be inspired to give one and you may say, no, this isn't for me. So either way, it's a win-win situation. All right, and let's seam it. Y'all have seen this here in the shop, I know. This is a fantastic sampler that, um, um, oh, I'm sorry, <laughs> let me move it over this way, that Nancy has made. And this is a great way to learn how to use your machine and utilize a lot of the stitches that are on it, but help you to be more precise with your stitching. So Nancy's going to be teaching this one on Saturday the 11th. As y'all notice, we're trying to get a lot of these Saturday classes in here that y'all like. So please sign up for that one. I know that class is filling up as well. All right. Now, y'all have got to see these fabrics. Oh, okay. So do I start with the one on the left here or the one on the right? Uh, I would start on the right. Okay. We're going to yes. start on the right. Here we go, y'all. Let me grab just two to get started. This is a new collection from Studio E, and it is called American Dreamer. This first one is the Ditsy Floral. Look, 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 look at that. Okay, I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm getting direction here. Look at that. This is beautiful tumbled blue and red flowers on a soft white background with a little cross hatching. Isn't that pretty? That's so pretty. 
Yeah. They're, they're mm -hmm. all in love here. Yes. They're all creating. Okay, this one is, uh, the name of this one is Freedom Blocks. Look at that. We've got love that. Yes. Bison, love Trucks, that. Sweet Land of Liberty, Home of the Brave, the Boots with the Flowers, the Liberty yeah. Bell, the Eagles, mm -hmm. you name it. It's all on that one. Oh, thank you. Ms. You're welcome. She sent me some right nearby. All right, this one is titled American Toss. Some of those same moving. elements, but then you've got the guitars, the outline of the U.S., the boots, again with the pickup trucks. I say it's a Ford, but that's just me. <laughs> you know, we all love what we love. There we go. That one is beautiful, too. Alrighty, now this one looks like they've already put in a lot of the patchwork work for you. Kind of crazy quilting going on there. So many of those pretty elements. That, that is so pretty. And then the red background with the white stars. Love that too. Yeah. Alright, and I think that's what we've gotten on that collection. Alright, now we're going to shift gears. And the first thing I'm going to show you is this fantastic panel. Mackenzie, you want to take one side of this? And girls, you tell us when we get in frame. Up. Oh, look at this. Now, you know what? The designer's name has gone right out of my head, but if you go to our website and click on the description of this panel, his name is in there. This designer is from Knoxville, and um, this, yeah, so these, when I first saw this, I said to the vendor, I said, hey, that's my mountains. And she said, yep, those are the Great Smoky Mountains, and it's just as pretty as it can be. We've got the moon up here in the corner. This is called the um, Sunrise, and I just think it's so pretty. It's Mountain Sunrise or Mountain Sunset, one of the others. Anyway, because you've got the moon and the sun here in both of them. The colors are just beautiful. So there's a whole collection that goes with it, though, to complement it. So let's start right here. Well, that's the panel. We've got that one. And then we have the um, Sweet Animal Patch. That's this one. Beautiful. And I just, oh, let's see. We've got foxes and bears and deer and butterflies or hummingbirds. And what else am I missing here? I'm looking at this side. What do y'all see over there? I think that's all of them. They're so sweet. I so love that little, little bunny. Bird. Oh, you see a bunny? There's yeah. a little bunny with the deer. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's so that's sweet. sweet. All right. All right. Here's the mama bears and the baby bears. And the rhododendron. And this is just running yardage. It just repeats and repeats the little butterflies and the flowers. The little mm -hmm. rhodod I love rhododendron. Mm -hmm. I grew up in the North Carolina mountains and rhododendrons were everywhere. Our azaleas. Mm -hmm. And here's the little baby foxes. Oh. And again, running yardage. Oh. Look at the little one asleep with his head on the rock. Mm -hmm. That's so sweet. Aww. And this one is more of that beautiful sunset with the pines. Ooh. Can you see that all like that a kaleidoscope? Oh, yeah. It is gorgeous. That would be beautiful. And the kaleidoscope pictures that I posted that Miss Eva Dell made. Now imagine this one looks oh, like that. Yeah. And we have got blenders to go with this, folks. Yeah. Oh my heavens. So pretty. And then someone mentioned us. Uh, What's the one where you stack all the panels and cut it that and open it? Stack. The stack and whack. Stack and whack. Using this or panel. Or attic windows. Mm -hmm. Yes, and someone else had said attic window using the panel. And then this one. Oh, yes. So imagine combining a couple of these and doing the kaleidoscope. got a little hummingbird in there. So, yes, the hummingbird, just sweet. Yep. Somebody came in the other day looking for hummingbirds. Mm-hmm. So there you go. Beautiful. All right, and that is the first two collections. 
Now comes the third one. And we have all the total, yeah. total change. Total change. I don't even know where to start on this one. Um, I think I'm going to start with the focus fabric. Okay. This one is from a Canadian company. So we've gone total 180 again. This is Spring Promises. Look at the bird with the crown. Yeah. And the corals and the peaches and the mm -hmm. blues. That soft blue is just so pretty. Yeah. Mm. So this one is some of our first spring fabrics and just love it. Mm -hmm. And then here is a beautiful coordinate with it. This one is um, Coral Growth is the name of this one. It's got the little bitty florets on mm -hmm. it and leaves. Little foliage. And then right next to it, I'm holding uh, Hello Sunshine Sky. Can you see all of those mm -hmm. together? Yes. I just think that coordinates. So pretty. Mm -hmm. So here you've got all the different sizes and the colors. This yellow one is called Pebbles something. Yep, Pebbles. And the detail on this, I don't know if it's showing up on the screen, but there's, it's like the yellow and then a softer color and then the blue. Mm -hmm. So you're getting a lot of dimension there. Yes. Now Joy loved this one. Y'all should have heard her when, oh, when she ooh, saw this. She's like, plaid. Oh, plaid, plaid. The plaid. <laughs> yeah, and the plaid is called Winding Trail Sunshine. I don't know where these people come up with these names. <laughs> but that one is oh. so pretty. And now when you put it with this, and this one is Winged Fairy Mist. Mm -hmm. So pretty. I know. Oh. That funky little bird. Yeah, isn't that cute? <laughs> the little bird and the little butterfly. Yeah. Let's see. Yeah, this, this one about sent Joy through the room. She was like, oh my goodness. Yes. This, this one right here is Fresh Blooms Dusk. So sweet. And again, there's all those colors from that first piece. Mm -hmm. right Hi, there. Tonda. <laughs> let's slide that one right mm -hmm. over. And let's pull up this one. Now, we've all been kind of looking at this one saying, what is that print? We think it's maybe the top of a wheat the little sh um, bloom from the top of wheat. Mm -hmm. And this one is called Overhead Blooms. Mm -hmm. I think I can print that a little bigger for those of us that are <laughs> hard of <Yeah>. seeing. <laughs> and then these little buzzy guys. Sweet little they bumblebees. They are precious. And they mm -hmm. are called busy workers, of course, mm -hmm. kind of like all of us. And that is the end of that. Yeah. So we hope y'all have enjoyed all of these beautiful fabrics that we are sharing with you today. We have just, oh, we are overwhelmed. We didn't expect all of them to land on us at once, but we are tickled that they did. We have got so many fabrics to share with you and classes and so many things going on. So please don't sit in the house and be cold come over here and be warm and stitch up something warm over here with us we love you all so and so's place 282nd avenue dayton tennessee so and so's place dot com 423-285-5959 say bye everybody bye, bye. bye. see you soon <laughs>